you would think that that maybe the stories of wrongful convictions that have been exposed by the hard work of many innocence projects now around North America and in other parts of the world, the hard work and the exposure of those wrongful convictions, the tragedies involved, the tragedies not only for the person who spent five or 10 or 15 years in prison for something they didn't do, but for the extended families and the children who had to live with these wrongful convictions, the, the sometimes massive compensation that occasionally gets paid rightfully to these wrongly convicted people, that the publicity about this doesn't seem to be enough to change uh, this instinctive 